Hi, my name is Rosalie Desmond and I'm an independent stamping up demonstrator from Australia. Today I'm going to show you a card that I've made with the Healing Hugs stamp set. I've used the rose from Healing Hugs and the leaf. On the first card here I've used the Get Well Soon sentiment and inside I've stamped Sending You Healing Vibes and also this foliage piece. On the second card I have used the Healing Hug stamp set for the flower as well but the sentiment has come from the Stitched All Around stamp set saying enjoy your special day and then on the inside I've stamped Best Wishes and I've used this stamp just here just to add a little bit more interest on the inside. Now these two cards use Gorgeous Grape, Rich Razzleberry and Lemon Lime Twist for the leaves. So this time I'm going to use a half an A4 sheet of cardstock in balmy blue. And you just simply fold that in half. And that's just a standard size card. For the background I've used a a um, sponge dobbler and this time I'm going to use blueberry bushel and all I do is I ink it up and then I randomly put spots on the card base Now I'm grabbing a piece of Whisper White cardstock, which is cut at five and a half centimeters by ten and a half centimeters. And it looks like I've just got some ink there from my hands, so I'm just going to flip that over. And I'm grabbing the Enjoy Your Special Day sentiment stamp from the Stitched All Around set. Making sure that I've got it the right way up. Gonna pop that down. I'll grab some Tombow liquid glue now to make the flower I'm grabbing some scrap whisper white the flower image and coastal cabana The flower image from the Healing Hug set is a what's called a distinctive stamp which means it gives us variations in the image without having to do any work at all. I don't really like the Coastal Cabana colour so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to clean my stamp. And I'm going to do it in balmy blue, which is the same as same colour as my card base. I think that might go better with my card. Then I'm grabbing the leaves from the Healing Hug set and inking them up in Lemon Lime Twist. Grab my paper snips and I'm going to fussy cut my flower. When you're fussy cutting it's much easier to move the paper rather than the scissors. It makes it much quicker and usually a lot more accurate. And I'll come back when this is all cut. Grab some Tombow liquid glue, pop a little bit of adhesive just under my leaf and connect the leaves to my flower. Now I'm putting some stamping dimensionals just to 
raise it up just a little bit. And just pop it down wherever you're happy. On the other cards, I have used some metallic sequins to dress up the card a little bit. This time I'm going to use some basic rhinestones. For the center of my card, I've used an eight and a half by 13 centimeter piece of Whisper White. And I'm gonna grab the blueberry bushel again, and the Best Wishes stamp. And I'm grabbing the long, long thin stamp from the stitched, uh, stitched all around stamp set, inking it up in lemon lime twist. Now I'll grab the Tombow liquid glue and pop the center in. So there you go, you can definitely change the look of your card by simply changing the sentiment or changing the colours. I hope you've been enjoying my videos, if you'd like to see more of them please subscribe below. Until next time, happy crafting, thanks very much.